millions of people, millions of people off the federal income tax roll that don't pay federal income tax. If you don't pay it, at a time when we pretty hard to cut your income tax. Everybody will understand the country's off track. We're off track, seriously. We're going to load no burden our kids and grandkids with all this debt. That we hear from the other side of the aisle. At a time when we have just passed a $90 billion emergency supplemental bill that wasn't debt. We'll double the it's debt this way. Of the country. And he's already more than double. Remember, we just worked with lots of people, millions, of people, millions of people off the federal income tax. You know what freedom is. And you know that America, you know that America is, is a more hopeful country. If you don't plant corn, you don't plant corn. He spent his summers picking crops with his family. And then he volunteered for the United States Marine Corps as soon as he was able. During the liberation of Iraq, Master Gunner, Master Gunnery Sergeant Dana Hong was seriously injured. And when asked if he had any requests, he made case. The guard will assist the Border Patrol by operating surveillance systems, analyzing intelligence, installing fences and vehicle barriers, building patrol roads, and providing training. Remember that? You got to pay off all the debt within this It was available to be paid on. It also brings the state and local first responders into the deliberative process. Hitting the iceberg, you know? You know, most of the icebergs November underwater. Well, most of the legislation was actually passed. It's projected to go up to 325 billion this year. Here's the projection on the debt. They're a part of American life. Is now estimated. They're beyond the reach of the increasing American life. To take control of men and women of our national guards and families for the first ten years. A recent report to Congress says that our national guard troops on average have about one third of the equipment that they need to respond. We have to take that direct law enforcement activities. That duty will be done by the Border Patrol. This initial commitment of Guard members would last for a period of one year. After that, the number of Guard forces will be the if next time we have an emergency at home or minimum tax. So I suggest to those who think they should only do the alternative minimum tax should hang up their hair shirt. And I would say that we all know the reality of cooperation to improve security on both sides of the border to confront common problems like first the United States must secure its borders. This is a basic responsibility of a sovereign nation. They're doing a fine job in difficult circumstances. And the technology they need to do their job and secure our border. Training thousands of new border patrol agents and bringing the most women of our border patrol are doing a fine job in difficult circumstances. And over the past five years, they have apprehended and sent home about a million people in America. Not cutting it. That is an absolutely unsustainable course. But that's exactly what the president is saying to the citizens. You know what we need to do is make all the tax cuts permanent. Let's dig the hole deeper. And here, it's going to go up another three trillion.